Premier Comrade Mielenkov, Comrade Agents, thank you for coming. Here's what we know so far. Ten years ago, the United States government covered up an invasion by an alien race known as Furons. And their primary agent was this hero, Cryptosporidium 137. Dangerous, unpredictable, now deceased. So, what is being problem? The problem, Conrad, is that neurons can clone themselves and pose convincingly as human. And they use these abilities to put Cryptosporidium 138 into the White House. And the American people are not noticing? <laughs> ah, right. Pull the other one. Even worse, this new crypto clone contains pure furon DNA, harvested from human brains by Orthopox 13, mastermind of the invasion. He also bears a mysterious new mutation, referred to only as the package. Ooh. These aliens pose a dire threat to the Soviet Union, comrades. And so, must be destroyed. As we speak, President Crypto is in Bay City, attending a youth cultural festival. And Orthopox? Conducting experiments in the Furon Mothership. Savages. Degenerates. There's only one way to deal with such men. Revolution. That can't be good. <laughs> Greetings, comrade. Mother Russia sent her regards. You expect me to beg, human? No, little Fioran. I expect you to die. Mine's free. Virtual pox, huh? Kinda 
constricting, ain't it? Well, beggars can't be choosers. I need to bring in some big guns. Uh, know where I can get my hands on some. I did manage to jettison some data cores before the mothership was hit. You might be able to recover some weapons from them, if you can find any. But it certainly won't be easy. Okay, so, where are the data cores? That's just it! They could have entered the atmosphere at any time, in any place, and therefore landed anywhere on the planet. I've managed to locate only one. It was ejected after my holopox unit, so it landed quite nearby. Well, I guess there's nothing left to do but scout the area and find that data core.
I don't understand it. We blew that alien spacecraft out of the sky, and yet the shriveled geriatric one somehow survived. This Jopas must be harder to kill than we thought. I spit on him! <laughs> Nonetheless, inform the Kremlin we shall proceed with the operation as planned. Tell them we need as much Revelade as they can ship, as quickly as they can ship it. Da, Agent Orincho. And our American distributor? He suspects nothing. In fact, he seemed quite enthusiastic about the whole idea. He thinks he'll be spreading revolution in a paper cup. And so he will. But not, I think, the sort he expects. Idealists. They spit on them! Stalin, he understood. Ideas may start revolutions, but guns and gulags finish them. Well, no matter. Soon the citizens of Bay City will be embarking on a very bad trip. <laughs> Still spinning. What the hell's going on around here? Why are those Ruskies gunning for us? Frankly, I'm more concerned with how the KGB managed such a successful twin strike. They're not usually so organized. We need to find them, Crypto, before they spring any more surprises. Okay, so what? I just start knocking on doors and doing the slicing dice? You do not. The KGB are hardly likely to hang around if you just start indiscriminately blowing away humans. Yeah, well, I was just brainstorming. Well, stop. I've done a little research in the criminal files of the local constabulary. Apparently, there's one informant in Bay City who always knows what's going down on the streets. They call him the Freak. The Freak, huh? Yeah, I I've heard about him. Cat's got connections all over town. He's kind of a burnout, though. From what I hear, he doesn't even need drugs anymore. He lives in his own personal mental lava lamp. But if any of those stinky monkeys knows what the KGB are up to, I bet he does. And I suggest you locate him and find out what he knows. All right, enough chit-chat. I'm off to find our little hippie friend, the Freak. Action. Maybe I'll ask the freak for some tips when I get back to the park. He has to fight the chicks off. Of course, he's also their dealer. Look! Up on the hill! It's a cop! It's a knock! It... 
Oh, it's just a freak again. That dude ain't right. Moon doggy, uh, I'm looking for a dude with his ear to the street. The kids call him the freak. You found him, but I'm all tapped out, man. The heat's coming down on me, you know. Try me next week. Freak, in all your drug-induced visions, I'm sure you've gained much uh, wisdom. Hey, I'm just trying to find me Camino, man. No different from you. But I've fried my share of brain cells, that's for sure. Super. Which is why I seek your, uh, well, for lack of a better word, let's uh, call it guidance. Right on, Seeker. What can I do you for? You're boring the love beads off of me here. Let, let, let's talk about something else. Well, what I need is information. What do you know about the Ivans in the cheap suits who crashed our party? You mean those KGB cats? Yeah, those dudes are straight, all right. They make Jack Lord look like Abby Hoffman. Only they didn't crash, man. They were invited. Who invited the KGB to uh, harsh our buzz? From what I hear, it was that cat who leads the commune. I don't know his real name, but he calls himself Coyote Bongwater. Which is pretty righteous. Supposedly, he's like this master of tantric meditation and spiritual healing. All I know is cat's got the chicks eaten out of his hookah. Okay, you piqued my interest. Where do I find Coyote Bong Water? Well, from what I hear, he's kind of paranoid. He doesn't hang out at the park for long. I heard he's got a pad someplace, but I don't know where. What I do know is he's cutting into my livelihood. Dude's been handing out this new turn on a drink like in a, in a can. He calls it Revelade. Ain't that a bitch? If you want him, that's your in. Find some Revelade and you'll probably find Coyote Bong Water. What's in this Revelade stuff? He claims it's like an all-natural elixir that enhances your cosmic awareness or something. Bong Water says it's the first shot in the global revolution against the man. Great. Great. Like, the monkeys aren't revolting enough already. Thanks, Freak. I gotta go find Coyote Bongwater. I can't believe I just said that. and take away my demon baby. If this Bongwater guy thinks he can buy my loyalty by handing out free samples of his homebrew mind-altering substance on Ashbury Street, then he's right! It's all about the buzz, man! And next week, we'll start one-on-one -on -one Shakti tutoring. I'll be giving each of you private Hands-on instruction in Kriyanish Pati, the highest state of tantric arousal. These sessions can run ten hours. So eat a good breakfast. <gasps> uh, 
That's it for today. Remember, wherever you go, I'll be there. The shine in your Japan, the sparkle in your China. Bodhisattva, Bodhisattva. Yeah! Goddamn flashbacks. Guess again, sunshine. Nice little setup. Guns, cheap Russian booze, teenage bra burning hippie chicks. Man after my own heart, if I had one. Then join us. We're about to free the people of this city. Soon they'll see the truth and embrace our beautiful new utopia. The Bay City Super Organic Communal Collective and Compost Farm. Are you with us, man? Am I with you? Dude, you're bogarting the brain stems. I'm gonna have to kill you. Yeah, yeah. Kill me? Run along, comrade. My men can handle this. Pacifist. What a crook. Perimeter breach! Get bomb water out of here! Hurry! Attacking! Bomb water is being in danger! Get him out of here! Now! Wanting to uh, oh, shooting. it hanging, freak. Uh, listen, I need a little more info. All right, but hurry it up, will you? You're making me nervous. Here's the thing. I, I found Bong Water, but he got away before I could ice him. Whoa. I don't know, man. You didn't tell me you were gonna get violent. You didn't ask. Smart hippie. Okay, okay. Maybe I've heard some things. He's gone underground and come up with a new plan to distribute his revelade. Great. What's that wacko up to now? Get this. Somehow he got his hands on a whole bunch of blimps. Blimps? What's he going to do? Start a tire company? It's not what's on the outside, man. It's what's on the inside. Gas. He's gonna gas the whole city with revelade! Wow, that's so wild it might just work. Well, I'll tell you this. Bongwater's been drinking his own revelade if he thinks his scheme's gonna work. Whatever. Hey, you coming to Jade's party? What? No, I'm gonna blow up Bongwater's blimps full of revelade. Didn't you hear me? Easy, man. Mellow out. What am I doing talking to this creep? Pox, we got a situation here. Bungwater must be drinking his own product. The freak says he's planning to fumigate Bay City with giant blimps full of Revelade gas. Great galaxies! That's so moronic, it just might work. 
So let's get flying, huh? I'm itching for some serious payback. Not so fast, my ultraviolet minion. My scan of the engine core has revealed some critical damage. Ah, oh, crap. The good news is ancient Furon landing beacons were left here eons ago during the war with the Martians. If you can find and activate one of those beacons, you'll be able to summon your saucer. Neat trick. And then, I kick a little monkey ass. You're the fuck! Shock report. Hey, look! Stop. Amused by languid Furon God, stab my idol with bolts of electricity. Attend the holy symbols of the green fire Landing zone activated. No sweat. It needs to be aired out every 5,000 parsecs or so. It appears the saucer took a hit. Or 12. On the way here. No, no, no. Don't say it. I'm afraid we can't possibly take off until the engine is repaired. Ah, oh, man. Luckily, I've detected more data calls from the mothership nearby. Containing repair parts up in flying. Once you're in the air, you can blow up blimps to your heart's content. Gotcha. I'll snatch up those repair pods and swing back to the saucer. Oh yeah. It's payback time. Very funny. I got places to see and people to kill. Stress get Three more weeks to life. Three more. That's not your property. Who's that? What the hell is that thing? Zack, we got us a thing here. Run for your life. You want to put your Is that yours? Then put it back. I have to destroy you in order to save you. Oh. Little green Who's dog. there? Right on! Time to boogie! Just in time, Crypto! Bombwater has launched his blimps at the city! You must stop them from polluting the air with Revelade! Here we go, Crypto! The blimps have entered the city! Oh, it's on! I'll be monitoring the level of Revelade in the atmosphere, but you'd better destroy those blimps quickly, Crypto, because if the Revelade level reaches 100% saturation, 
Our base city brain farm will be turned into a useful den of unmotivated degenerates sitting in front of their TV screens twiddling their thumbs. <laughs> Just tell me where Bong Water is so I can whack him and get back to making hot monkey love. When you're packing a new Ferrari, you don't want it gathering dust in the garage, you know what I'm saying? Not really. And Bong Water? What can I say, man? Nobody's seen the dude. Well, nobody's at Prudence, I guess. Who's Prudence? Uh, his insurance broker? Ah, dear Prudence. No, she's Bongwater's new protege. Kind of a revolutionista in training. <laughs> Anybody knows where Bongwater's at? It'd be Prudence. It sounds like a real firecracker. Maybe I should introduce myself. All right. I'm off to introduce myself to Prudence. See if I can convince her to give up bong water. Buzz, baby. Run for your life! I want to head down to the park, but if I do, I just know that Prudence chick's gonna try to unsnap my 501s again. Hey, run, get it over with. Oh. The bus. <laughs> she owns the park now that she's Bongwater's old lady. Bitch! Flashbacks. <laughs> 
I'm getting a little tired of that. Brothers and sisters, children of the revolution, this is the dawning of the age of aquarium. My name is Ruth Kane. Like me, many of you joined the American Liberation Front as a way of getting back at your rich suburban parents for subjecting you to an adolescence of obscene luxury. Look, Princess, we ain't here for the opening act. Where's Coyote Bombwater? Sadly, our leader, Coyote Bombwater, cannot be with us today because he is setting in motion a grand design to transform this entire city into a countercultural utopia. Bay City is about to become one big happy commune. Suck on that! All right, so what's Bongwater up to this time? So how can Coyote Bongwater possibly free the minds of a whole city the same way he freed our minds with Revelate? How did I know that? Revelade sounds yummy to the tummy, so uh, where do I get me some? That's the best part! Our brothers and sisters are about to deliver the final batch of Revelade to our leader, Coyote Bongwater! He's gonna pour it into the bay! Soon the masses are gonna be begging us to lead them in revolution! Those Revelade trucks could be a serious pain in my ass, and I haven't blown anything up for at least ten minutes. Much like a figurative transforming robot, oh, there's more to this than meets the eye. This Revelade isn't a coincidence. It's an attack! Take out those trucks immediately!
title. Now my chance to nail that sleazy weasel once again. Revolution is coming, man! Watch me fly! Yoko screwed up for everybody. Lane! You learn! Sit back right, man. That was so Agent Dorinchov, come in! Uh, I failed! You'll have to... start the revolution without me! Yet. Yet? B but This city is useless to us now. I mean, have you seen these people? They make the students in Prague look like a meeting of the Politburo! We shall destroy this degenerate city and return to the Soviet Union with the spacecraft fragments we have managed to retrieve. But what about freeing America from the tyranny of capitalist consumerism? Do not despair, comrade. The party will long remember your efforts to cripple your decadent nation. You shall not have died in vain, or in your lot. But... no! No! I wanted to save America, not destroy it! Oh, man! What have I done? Uh, excuse me. Sometimes it's kinder just to put them down.
So, our Furon God is buried in effigy all over Earth, huh? <laughs> Who'd have thunk? Ah, oh, yes. Arkvoodle of the Sacred Crutch. Prodigious in size, legend in potency and stamina. You put me in mind of him, Crypto, with your new clone's pure Furon DNA and restored genitalia. Yes, you are the spitting image of... Ah, oh, good gonads! The prophecy! What? What prophecy? It foretells the coming of a savior who will reassert the sexual dominance of the Furon race. Tis written in the holy book of Fudenga. And lo, a son of Arkvoodle shall rise newly born to prepare ye for that day when Arkvoodle shall come again. Wait a minute. It sounds incredible, I know, but Crypto... What if it's true? What if you're... the one? Hmm, I did take a red pill this morning. Okay, just for the sake of argument, let's say you're right. How the hell am I supposed to bring about the second coming of Arkvoodle? The scriptures say Arkvoodle will return when enough seekers believe in him again. You mean, like, Tinkerbell? It's something like that. But Crypto, this is ideal! Humanity is desperate to reconnect the physical and spiritual! All that's needed is for you to spread the good pickup line of Arkvoodle! They're bound to follow you! You want me to start a cult? Basically. Hmm... Religion is the opiate of the masses. I like it, but how do I do it? Well, humans tend to sublimate their individuality into tribal units bound by social and political commonality. Such groups are full of docile sheep, ripe for conversion to the way of the sacred crotch. Hail, Arkvoodle! Time to get religious, hallelujah. Before you do, it would be wise to go and seek the blessing of Arkvoodle himself. What? You mean one of those statues with a pigeon crap on it? Precisely. Seek the blessing of Arkvoodle and your cult will prosper. If you say so, but I'm gonna feel like a putz. I've ever seen! The glory of our Kudum grows 
from the highest state of chaotic fecundity. When the ring turns orange and the population's nerves are frayed, then shall the ground be fit to sow, and the masses shall follow. Thus spake Ark Buddha. Bow, shika, bow, down. Go, son of Arkhoodle, take the sacred crotch to the masses! My gun was getting lonely. Man, I hate those guys. And I didn't think it was possible for anyone to wear worse suits than Majestic. So what you got on those sneaky monkeys? Bongwater's last transmission betrayed the location of the KGB base of operations. They're working from an abandoned prison island in the middle of the bay. Gotcha. I'll blast that island back into the ocean with the rest of the slime. Eat for it. That Agent Orinchov told Bongwater they were going to destroy the entire city somehow. You'd best scout the island first and find out what they have planned. All right. I'm going in to get a piece of the rock. Show yourself! 
Don't move a muscle! Who's there? Don't make me crack you! My patience is at an end, Gospodin. I'm shaking in my booties. You guys make Americans look clever. Silence! The workers' revolution is inevitable. Right. Uh, you don't really know much about capitalism, do ya, Ivan? I know corrupt corporations fatten themselves off the toil of the American worker, even as they pull the strings of the American government. Exactly! You can't beat that kind of muscle! Not even with nuclear time bombs hidden all over Base City? I've had wet dreams that weren't this good. Comrade, destroy these documents before he finds out where the bombs are hidden. For Sovetsky Soyuz! Damn it, well, we need Bay City. Hey, Ruski, give me those docks. Kill the Soviet agent and get that dossier, Crypto. We need to know where those Pick up the human file so that we may learn the location of the nuclear bombs. Are you completely corrupt or simply stupid? It is written in the Book of Divine Fabrications that the great god of the sacred crotch was not made and cannot be unmade. Arkvoodle is, always was, and always will be. And for once they got it right. Fire at my idol with your disintegrator array! Uh, Nonetheless, I shall unlock the landing zone. Thanks for playing.
Well done, Crypto! However, I've reviewed the dossier and discovered something disturbing. America is not the only target in the KGB sites. Agent Orenshaw has been running his operation from Albion in England. I want to know how the KGB managed to derail our mission. So it's off to Albion! Tally-ho what? important things to do.